Uh, can you please analyze Sandbox? Uh, let's take a look at Sandbox. All right, let's take a look at Sandbox. Get rid of this. All right, let's get back to the regular candles. Uh, looks like Sandbox is breaking out. Uh, breaking out of this. Uh, out of this. Uh, uh, downtrend right here. Excuse me, guys. So, sandbox seventy eight cents right now. Uh, let me show you some targets. Sandbox again breaking out of this trend right here. Uh, let me show you some targets. A uh, big targets is right here from from ninety two cents all the way up to a dollar seventeen cents. So this is a range right here. Lots of confluence in this range right here. Lots of confluence right here. Uh, this is your first target. Uh, 92 cents, you know, all the way up to a dollar 17 cents. If we can break out of that range, a retest towards a dollar 50 cents is more likely. Now, this is, you know, short term potential price targets. Uh, but of course, there's a lot of work that needs to be done. Uh, you still have, you know, a lot of confluence right down in this range right here, you know, around, uh, around 80 cents. You can see how much confluence in this range. So a lot of work needs to be done. You know, it's going to take some serious buyers to push the price of sandbox you know, all the way up into this 92 cents and, you know, a dollar 72 cents, a uh, dollar 17 cents range. If we zoom out and we look at the weekly, very, very similar to 
a lot of these other projects. If I'm looking at Sandbox right now, I mean, you guys can clearly see this is a project that is still in, you know, a downtrend. I mean, the chart of Sandbox actually looks, you know, very, very bad. You know, if you were in <laughs> when the project went from, you know, 70 cents all the way up to $8 and you didn't take profits. This, this must have been, you know, brutal to your portfolio. I mean, this is ridiculous, guys. You know, talk about unsustainable rallies. I mean, something like this, you know, a straight line like this, you have to take profits, guys. You have to take profits. So, you know, Sandbox, just looking at the weekly time, uh, let me show you guys, you know, if you... If you if you are you know bullish on this project, uh, let me show you. You know something. So personally, if I was well, I am interested in this project. You know, it's not on my. It's not on my uh, you know my my shopping list, but I am interested in you know sandbox. So personally. I would like to be an accumulator uh, right down here between, you know, 75 and 56 cents. This is where I would like to be an accumulator. This is where I would like to start, you know, building my position. But I'll be a happier investor if I can accumulate majority of my bags, you know, right down in this range right here. So when we talk about another potential crash in the old coin market, uh, you can clearly see the same box is going to have to hold, you know, these levels right here, because otherwise, you know, this is a project that could potentially drop you know, all the way down to around 37 cents. And that will be a 50% drop from, you know, the current price. Again, you can't ignore, you know, this potential risk right here. This is something that you have to consider, you know, if you are building an old coin portfolio. Uh, we are still trading below moving averages. The 21 weekly EMA is all the way around, you know, 112 cents. And you can see the last time, you know, we broke above the 21 weekly EMA. I mean, this right here was the beginning of the last bull market. And let me show you what that did to, you know, the performance of uh, Sandbox. We broke above the 21 weekly around this level, push all the way up to the top right here. And that was a 10,000 plus percent performance. I mean, absolutely ridiculous, guys. And if you trade the 21 weekly EMA, and if you trade, you know, the 21 weekly EMA, I mean, you can see how nicely, you know, this would have been as an entry. And you would have stayed in your position, you know, all the way up to, you know, all the way up to somewhere around here. Uh, you would have got out when we dropped below the 21. You would have got back in, you know, somewhere around 45 cents. 
and you would have you would have uh uh you know you would have stayed in you know all the way up to around you know three dollars and of course you know pushing to around eight dollars if you're not taking profits you know along the way again that just because you maybe don't have a strategy so just looking at sandbox right now guys the risk is there uh, even if we do push all the way up to around you know a dollar 12 cents we could potentially get rejected and drop all the way down into this range right here now, of course we don't have to there is no certainty in the market but you can you know dismiss the fact that we have you know a 50% potential move to the downside that is you know same box right there short term this could potentially be you know a nice rally you know that takes us uh it looks like we're breaking above the 21 that takes us you know up into this you know short term range 